Hey everyone, my name is Deepak Mehta. So, if you are still spending time in taking meeting notes inside your meetings, then this video is for you. Because in this video, I'm going to be sharing with you how to automate notes taking inside your WebEx meeting. So let's dive in. To automatically capture meeting notes and action items, your WebEx admin needs to enable WebEx Assistant inside your meetings. So what is WebEx Assistant? WebEx Assistant is a voice interactive assistant which allows you to make your meetings more actionable and more productive with just one click or with just one voice command. So how cool is that? So once you have WebEx Assistant enabled for you, you can just hover your mouse over WebEx Assistant and turn it on for your meetings. And then to capture action item and highlights, just hover your mouse over WebEx Assistant once again, and then click view captions and highlights. This will open up another window on the right hand side of your screen. And this is where you will see the real-time captions getting populated for all the meeting participants inside your meeting. So there are two ways of capturing meeting notes and action items using WebEx Assistant. Uh, one way is by just going into captions and as people are speaking, you can hover the mouse over the text you want to capture and click on blue highlight button that would appear on the top. Then go to highlight section and you would see the highlighted notes there. The other method is by giving voice commands. Like, okay Webex, please take note, we need another design by next week. Or, okay Webex, please create an action item completing product roadmap by next week. Now go over to highlight section where you would see action item and notes have been created. So once you've captured meeting notes and action items, in order to retrieve your meeting notes, you can log into your WebEx site. In my case, I log into deepakmeta.mywebex.com, which is my WebEx site. And then I'll go to meetings, then completed meetings. And here I will see all the highlights and I can do a search by search bar or I can select any of the meeting highlights and either comment, share or delete. If I want to share, then I can cl click on share button and then it'll open up another pop-up window where I can put the email address of the person that I want to share with. As easy as that. So you see how easy it is to capture meeting notes and highlights without even writing a single word. I hope you find it useful. Thank you so much for watching my video. Please do subscribe or like if you found it useful. We'll see you in the next video. Thank you.